hi everyone in this video i'm going to show you how to crochet this cute cut baby shoe it's for newborn watch out and see we start with twine white twine for the sole so you start by making a knot then after that you make 13 chains 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 then after making your 13 chain you walk half double crochet three times on the next hole so we, we will jump the first hole on the next hole we walk half double crochet three half double crochet one Two, three, then on the next hole, make one half double crochet. Next hole, one half double crochet, which is the second one. So we've done one half double crochet on the next two holes. So we complete with eight holes. That is making it ten holes. As in working, you will work half double crochet on the next eight holes. Plus the two holes we've already done. That makes it ten holes. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. I see. Then on the next hole, we walk six half double crochet on the last hole. Six half double crochet. That is making half double crochet six times on the last hole. One. The same hole. Two. The same hole. Three, the same hole. Four, the same hole. Five, the same hole. Six, you can see it. Then you walk half double crochet on the next ten holes. One, two. Three. So you continue to work on the next 10 holes. Yeah, you can see it. So on the last hole, you work three half double crochet. 
one the sample two the sample three this is the first round so you complete this round by slip knitting on the last on the first hole you crocheted you slip knit this is the end of first round so to start the second round you make one chain you walk two half double crochet on the next three holes two half double crochet on the next three holes one on the same hole two then on the next hole one the same hole two then on the next hole one on the same hole two so you continue by working one half double crochet on the next ten holes one on the next hole two on the next hole three on the next hole four on the next hole five on the next hole six so you complete until you make ten holes yeah you can see it so you the next thing is to walk two half double crochet on the next six holes one two three four five six you walk two half double crochet on the next six holes one the same hole two the next hole one the same hole two which is two next hole one the same hole two so you've done on three holes so you continue until you make two half double crochets on the remaining three holes yeah after that you walk one half double crochet on the next ten holes one next hole two next hole three next hole So you continue until you work on 10 holes. Then after that, you work two half double crochets on the next three holes. One, the same hole. Two, on the next hole. One, the same hole. Two, on the next hole one the same hole two so you slip knit on the first hole so we've come to the end of the second round you can see it so for the third round you make one chain then on the next hole you walk two half double crochet one on the same hole two then on the next hole you walk one half double crochet 
one. On the next hole, you work two half double crochet. One on the same hole. Two. On the next hole, one half double crochet. One. On the next hole, two half double crochet. One. The same hole. Two. On the next hole, one half double crochet. Yeah, you can see it. So the next thing to do now is to work one half double crochet on the next 10 holes. One half double crochet on the next 10 holes. Yeah, you can see it. Then on this curve now, we have 12 holes on this curve. So on these 12 holes, we will start on the first hole. We work one half double crochet. Then on the next hole, we work two half double crochet next hole one half double crochet next hole work two half double crochet until we work on the next 12 holes so we start one half double crochet then on the next hole you work two half double crochet one on the same hole Two. Then on the next hole, one half double crochet. One. Then on the next hole, two half double crochet. One. On the same hole, two. Then on the next hole, one half double crochet. So you continue with that until you work on 12 holes. We've already worked on 5 holes. So on 6th hole, two half double crochet one the same hole two then on the seventh hole you know we we, we did two half double crochet on the sixth hole then seventh hole we have to repeat that two half double crochet one the same hole two then on the eighth hole, one half double crochet. One. Then on the ninth hole, two half double crochet. One. The same hole. Two. Then on the tenth hole, one half double crochet. Then on the eleventh hole, two half double crochet. One. The same hole two then on the twelfth hole one half double crochet you can see it so you walk one half double crochet on the next ten holes yeah on the remaining six holes now we will start by walking one half double crochet on the first hole then two half double crochet on the next hole one half double crochet on the next, two half double crochet on the next until you work on the remaining six holes. We start by making one half double crochet. One. Then on the next hole, two half double crochet. One. The same hole. Two. On the next hole, one half double crochet. Which is on the third hole. On the fourth hole, two half double crochet. One on the, the same hole, two on the fifth hole, one half double crochet. On the sixth, that is the last hole, two half double crochet. One on the same hole, yeah. So we end by slip knitting on the first hole. sorry so for us to end just pass your crochet pin and leave it like that 
so we've come to the end of crocheting the sew we made three three rounds for the sew at the end of this three round if you count the holes you will see that we have 56 holes 56 holes to check if you get it correct just count the holes you will have 56 holes then for the fourth round so we change the color we change our color the color of our trade we will start with green just use the green for the slip knit Then we have to cut off the white and continue with the green. Make one chain. Then we start working one half double crochet all round the sole. One half double crochet round. So we start. So we're crocheting from the upper hole. So don't crochet this way. I mean, don't crochet this way. You crochet from the upper hole. Like this. Like this. Like this. So you don't crochet this way. Rather, you crochet like this. So we start one half double crochet. On the next row, one half double crochet. So you crochet from the upper part of the hole. Next row, one half double crochet. Next row, one half double crochet. So you continue with that until crochet around the sew. Yeah, you can see it. So you end by slip knitting on the first row. You can see. So at the end of fourth row, you should have the same 56 holes so to check if you get what you made you check you count the holes it should be 56 holes to start the fifth round you make one chain then make one half double crochet on the next 14 holes one half double crochet on the next 14 holes one Two, three, four. Continue until you work on fourteen holes. Yeah, after working on fourteen holes, on fourteen holes, the next thing to do now is to work one half double crochet on the next hole. Then you work one half double crochet on the next two holes. As in, make one half double crochet on the next two holes by reducing two holes to one. Then we start. One half double crochet. Then on the next hole, we walk one half double crochet on the next two holes. So if you yawn out, so don't complete the half double crochet. Yarn on the next row. You can see it. So now you complete. You complete it. That is one. On the next row, 
one half double crochet then you repeat one half double crochet on the next two holes to make it to reduce two holes to one don't complete this half double crochet on the next hole then you yarn it out you can see this is the second one so on the next hole you make one half double crochet you can see it then on the next hole you make one half double crochet on the next two holes to reduce two holes to one holes so you've already done on two holes you have we've already made two of that so you repeat more more seven times making it nine so we, we already have two of that you make it more seven times making it nine i have made eight of that so it's remaining one complete is nine is nine in number so what we are doing now is we are trying to get this curve that is it so after that the next thing to do is to work one half double crochet on the on the remaining 14 holes one half double crochet on the remaining 14 holes The next hole, the next hole, so you continue. Yeah, after working one half double crochet in the next 14 holes, you slip knit on the first hole to end this fifth round. So we start the sixth round. So to start the sixth round, you make one chain, then make one half double crochet on the next 14 holes. One half double crochet on the next 14 holes. One, two, three. Four. so you continue to make on 14 holes yeah after working on 14 holes so the next thing to do now is to work one half double crochet on the next two holes as in work one half double crochet here next hole one half double crochet then on the next two hole you work one half double crochet on two holes to reduce it to one so for this round now you do one half double crochet, one half double crochet, one half double crochet on two holes. One half double crochet, one. Next hole, two. Then the next hole, we do one half double crochet on two holes. So don't complete it. Next hole. There you complete. You can see that is one of that one half double crochet. One next hole, one half double crochet. Two then on the next hole, one half double crochet on two holes. One don't complete. Next hole, two then complete.
yes so we've done two of that so now we do one half double crochet on the next three holes on the next three three holes you know we did one half one half double crochet on two holes before we reduce two holes to one then one half double crochet on two holes reduce two holes to one then here now we do one half double crochet on three holes one next hole two next hole three then in the next hole you make one half double crochet on two holes to reduce it one one don't complete on the next hole then you complete Then on the next hole, one half double crochet. On the next hole, one half double crochet. Then on the next hole, we do one half double crochet on the next two holes. One, don't complete. Next hole, one, then you complete. Then make one half double crochet on the next two holes. One on the next hole. Two. You can see. So we have four of that here. Which is one, two, three. And four you can see it so we complete this round by making one half double crochet on the next 14 holes yeah at the end of six round you make one chain so to start seventh round Sorry, at the end of six round you slip knit. To start seven round, you make one chain. Then after making one chain, you make one half double crochet on the next fourteen holes. One half double crochet on the next fourteen holes. One. So you continue to make on fourteen holes. Then after working on 14 holes, so the next thing to do now is to work one half double crochet on the next hole. Then on the next two holes, you work one half double crochet to reduce two holes to one. Next hole, one half double crochet. Next hole, one half double crochet on the next two holes to reduce two holes to one. So we start. one half double crochet then on the next hole one half double crochet on the next two holes if you're not done complete this half double crochet then on the next hole you're not then complete then on the next hole one half double crochet So we've done one of that. The next hole, one half double crochet on the next two holes. One. Two. On the next hole, one half double crochet. On the next hole, one half double crochet. So we are doing this one too. So we've done one half double crochet then one half double crochet on the next two holes to make it one one half double crochet one half double crochet on the next two holes to make it one 
then we make one half double crochet in the next two holes as in one half double crochet one half double crochet then on the next hole you make one half double crochet on the next two hole to reduce it to one one hole then on the next hole one half double crochet on the next hole one half double crochet on the next two holes on the next hole one half double crochet yeah you can see it so you can so you complete by working half double crochet on the next 14 holes to complete this round so at the end of seventh round you slip knit to end then to start eighth round you make one chain then after making one chain you make one half double crochet on the next 14 holes one half double crochet on the next 14 holes one two three so you continue to make on 14 holes so after crocheting on 14 holes the next thing to do now is to do half double crochet on the next two holes to reduce it to one continue to have two half double crochet one half double crochet on the next two holes to reduce they reduce it to one then we start one don't complete the next hole two then you complete one we've done one now then on the next hole you did the same don't complete on the next hole then you complete then on the next hole we've done two of that on the next hole you do the same thing don't complete then complete then on the next hole you do the same don't complete on the next hole then you complete we've done how many one two three four four of that we repeat it one more times next hole don't complete then on the next hole then you complete so we did it five times then after that then you complete this round by making one half double crochet on the next 14 holes One half double crochet on the next 14 holes. Next hole. One half double crochet on the next 14 holes. So you continue until you con crochet on 14 holes. So at the end of 8th round, you slip knit to end. So to start the ninth round you make one chain make one half double crochet on the next 14 holes one half double crochet on the next 14 holes two three so continue until you work on 14 holes so after working half double crochet on 14 holes, ne the next thing now is to work half double crochet on the next two holes to reduce it to one. One, the next hole. Yeah, so you complete. Then on the next hole, you make 
one half double crochet then on the next row you make one half double crochet on the next two holes to reduce it to one don't complete on the next row you yarn out then you complete so you complete by crocheting one half double crochet on the next 14 holes on the next 14 holes so at the end of ninth round you slip knit to end yeah you can see it so for us to continue the tenth round so the tenth round no more reduction now so you continue making one half double crochet round the shoe and you make up to 13 rounds so we are now we've completed the ninth round so we start making one half double crochet round the sole so if you count this hole now you see that if you get your own the thing should be 31 holes in total if you count the holes at one holes so you continue making one half double crochet on the 31 holes on the 10th round so you make it on the 10th round 11th round 12th round and 13th round 11 10 11 12 13 you make one half double crochet on the next on the on the round of the shoe that is on the on the 31 holes yeah you can see it i'm done with the 13th round so we will start with the 14th round so on that 14th round we'll be working with white twine you can see it that is what gave it this design here so that 14th round will be the last round we will use so you continue making but before that you slip knit with white then make one chain Then after that, you continue with one half double crochet round the shoe. So remember, we still have 31 holes. So round the 31 holes. Yeah, at the end of 14th round, this is how it will look like. So the next thing is to fold it to give it this design. Just fold it a little bit. yeah you can see it yeah please if you love this video do wait well to subscribe and share to your friends subscribe to stay tuned for more tutorials on how to crochet footwear both baby shoes and adult shoes thank you